What's up, William Baron here with Darkfakes.net, and what we're going to be doing here is that we're going to be going in and creating an insert form. And so basically it's going to have all the same information here. So that what we're going to do here is go ahead and create a new form. So you come over here to create blank form. And so we've got our form right here. And actually we're just going to come over here and we're going to choose the fields that we need so we don't need the user ID we just want the username address state and that's basically it copy it and come over here and choose paste and I don't think that's gonna work is it copy and no don't have nothing over here so All right, Wayne Barron here with darkfakes.net and we are inside of Microsoft Office Access. I almost forgot where I was at. And what we're gonna be doing here is we're gonna be creating an insert form. So let's go ahead and jump into it. Come over here to the Create tab, Blank Form. Okay, and let's come over here to Show All Tables and we want just our users. So we want username, password, address, and state. And so, just like we did before, we want to go ahead and click on here, get to the right place, there we go, and we want to remove layout. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, choose everything here and move it over here where we need it at. And then let's go ahead and bring our username and password up a little bit from our... Um, from our address and let's come over here and let's go ahead and do background and we're going to change this to theme 5 we'll come over here to our border style no border color and we're going to go to theme 5 on that one let's change this one to theme 8 yep that's better and now we're going to go to special effects and we're going to add in a shadow so now it basically looks like so. And uh, let's go ahead and change our font color as well. And that's going to be right here. So let's go ahead and that looks good. Alrighty, now so we got this. And so let's come over here and choose our buttons. We want a um, add new record. Well, actually, uh, yeah, add new record. We want to have the pencil. Click finish, and then we're going to right click. It's automatically going to put these over here inside of these forms, and so we want to go ahead and remove from layout. And go ahead and bring it down to here. Okay, now we got another one, and then we're going to do delete next trash can finish and then we want one more and we're gonna have this one as save next and we want the check mark finish okay so let's go ahead and there we go layout and remove okay let's bring them over here put them in order Okay, and uh, let's go ahead and jump over here, move it over just a little bit. Okay, so now whenever we run this, all right, so let's go ahead and create a new record and let's add in our test username and our test password, 1234 Southeast Main Street, and this is in Florida. And then we go ahead and click on the check and then it should have created this record. So we come over here, let's refresh all, and there we go, we got test username and test password. Now, what if we wanted to delete that record? The only thing we gotta do is click on the little recycle trash can here, and then it's gonna pop up a warning. You are about to delete one record, choose yes or no, we're gonna choose yes. And then we come back over here to our users, and as you can see, it's showing the number of the pound deleted. So we refresh all and it deletes that record. Okay, this is William Barron here with darkeffects.net. Y'all have a rocky week now. Bye.
Bye-bye.